kids, it's Nikki Jackson here with another art video for you. In today's video I'm going to be sharing the process of making this marker storage case that I recently made. It was inspired by Bailey J's Z Kitty Z Days and uh, I managed to find her video and took inspiration from that. So I hope you enjoy it and if you've got any questions please leave them in the comments below. So to start with I kind of wrote out um, all the measurements that Bailey gave. I also took some measurements of um, the size of the markers and uh, what kind of spacing that I would need. So I'll put all that in the description below so you have that info for yourself. So now I'm starting to mark out on the foam board. I had two A1 sheets of um, foam board that I used and I did need a little bit more than that. Luckily I had some scraps available so I could use those for the end pieces. So um, here I am using a Spectrum Noir marker just to make sure that um, the space is going to be wide enough. I think this is the actual bottom of the marker storage case so um, I'm just making sure that it will fit. So I'm just marking everything out. It was kind of fiddly in my little studio getting down on the floor and uh, trying to measure and cut it all out but I managed. So here are all the pieces cut out so far. I've got the shelves, a couple of the dividers and um, I think I might have some side pieces as well. They are the start of the, design, the dividers. And here I've just laid it out to make sure that the markers fit. They're not glued down yet. I was just making sure that the measurements were right. So that's with the next shelf put on top. So I've started to glue the dividers in place. I use a hot glue gun which was um, kind of an interesting experience. Let's just say you have to be super careful with them. So here it is starting to be put together and these are the different tiers as I was gluing them. So now we've got everything glued together. Some of the dividers are a little wonky but um, I'm pretty pleased overall. The side um, of the case and the back didn't quite measure up. Um, probably I cut it wrong. So I've used some, um, some nice pretty paper to just kind of disguise that a bit on the sides and the top. I didn't bother to put any on the back because it's against the wall so you won't see it. So then the exciting moment of putting it on the desk. Now um, I had to rearrange the desk quite a bit because this is quite bigger than my other ones. So there I am putting my little vinyl figures on top and my uh, lamp and pencil sharpener. And I'm starting to put my Copics in there which is really exciting and here are the Spectrum Noirs and Pro Markers. So um, super excited and I've got plenty of space for new markers when I buy them as and when. So I'm um, super chuffed with that. I've since moved things around a little bit more. Um, I've put it more in the middle and moved my pin board above um, on the shelf above. But I'm um, super pleased with it and I hope you enjoyed this. I'll catch you again next time. Bye for now.